Okay, one weird thing adjusting to like using the monitor. I feel like the weirdest thing for me is that I'm looking farther. Like I used to look at like this. Now I'm looking down. I almost. I might want to get something to set the monitor on so that it's like more like this instead of like this. I still haven't moved my CRT off my desk. It's still just sitting there. I haven't wanted to touch it. It is large. Any reason I changed? A few. A few. Uh, one, it's just more convenient, especially if I'm going to be doing more casual stuff for like switching because I can use the monitor for all of my gaming and I don't have to be like, okay, I'm playing here. Now I'm playing here. And, you know, and then like move everything around and switch monitors. Uh, but also just in general, um, not having to worry about the CRT. My CRT is enormous. It's a 27 inch CRT. And, and if I do switch to Wii U in the future, which I'm not ruling out, then I'll already be used to playing on it. No, yesterday was really, really fun. Yeah, for those who don't know or missed it, yesterday, uh, GDQ, for, uh, for one of their hotfix shows is Time Capsule, which is just like a showcase run of uh, game prominent games from certain years. And so I did Paper Mario All Cards and got a 257, which is, that honestly, that's really good for a marathon. No, yeah, spoilers. Spoilers, it was a good run. <laughs> Oh, thanks. To, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yeah, it was it was really, really good. I'm going to have to see if they're going to upload it to YouTube because I want to get a copy of the VOD. Also, if I submit things, if I submit all cards to GDQ, like regular GDQ, it'd be nice to be like, here's your own video of me doing it for you. <laughs> That's my submission. Second shirt on for an hour. Come on, do you really want, like, look at this shirt. Imagine wanting a shirt to cover up God's intended console shirt. But the DS Lite is God's intended console. You sure? Heart rate monitor when? When? No. <laughs> Do you watch the stream live? <laughs> yeah, just go watch my PBs. That's where I was good. I wonder if people who only ever watch PBs have like a warped perception of how good people are at video games. They don't see all the hundreds of runs that die. They just see the one that was like significantly above average. And I want to, I want to like let them. I want to give people hope. I want to let them build up their pyramid and then heck them right at the end. <laughs> nope, not doing that. I mean, unless you want to watch a tutorial on how to use Eldstar, dude. I hadn't done that for like literally a year, and then now I've done it twice in like two weeks. I just like hit A. I was like, oh yeah, that's the question. Like, yep. <laughs> <sighs> That's unfortunate. Well, now I'm almost definitely, I probably won't even, <laughs> now I might not even finish everything up to chapter eight, but I'll get as much done as, in the run as I can. Yeah, let's switch to Wii U so that we can go faster. Oh God. Oh my God. <laughs> Dude, why can't I get this badge? <laughs> oh, actually good movement there for once in my life. Okay, we take those. Someday I run TTUID for fun. It's probably the next game I'll take serious after this one. Like whenever I run a game, which thus far has really only ever been this game, like I, I degen the heck out of it and don't really run any other games. Let's get the star piece in here. I love, so if you do record skip, the records just chill in here. But we literally don't care. <laughs> we just want the star piece underneath. The high level gameplay, they come for the memes in the community. I think I like to think that the people who watch my stream come for a bit of both. The mix is good. I wouldn't want to have just I honestly wouldn't want to have just for one. Well, if it was just for the community and stuff, I guess I'd be fine with that. But I also like I like <laughs> I like people at least giving the impression that I'm kind of okay at video games. No, it does not include max level. Uh, exclamation point hundo will explain everything. Uh, but a better way to think about it, the way we have it defined, is it's more like collect all the things instead of do all the things like we also don't fight all the bosses there's no requirement in the definition to do that the main exception being we do still do the dojo but only because uh there's a permanent key item that you get for that which is the diploma uh if there was a way to dupe star pieces would skipping quiz mode be allowed for 100 funny you ask because there is technically a way to dupe star pieces i don't know if it's faster but there is a way uh but no there's like a we, we do have like a pseudo source requirement type thing i guess okay i'm not gonna lie to you the definition of 100 percent is like it's 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 kind of wonky <laughs> but it makes for a good run you're doing something fun in the moment knowing you're procrastinating welcome to my college experience 
Don't get me wrong, I still had a lot of fun in college. I, I enjoyed it. But the number of times that I was not procrastinating whenever I was doing something fun, it, it wasn't a high number of times. Also, anyone wondering, we are behind PB probably, but we're not actually 11 minutes behind. And what, by probably, I mean definitely. Like, college time never ends. Learning is good. Learning is a good thing, for sure. These days I try and focus the, the... It's a lot easier to learn things, though, if you're, like, you know, interested in the subject matter. Now I can dedicate my brain power to memorizing percentages of things happening in Paper Mario. Like the fact that it's a 16% chance to get three... Uh, four capped right here. We'll see if I finish this run. <laughs> I'm gonna probably say there's not like if i did finish this there's what like three hours left it more than three hours that would put it at 12 one two third oh god i'd like to at least get to quizmo and sync up and see how close i like how far behind i was but yeah calculators chilling because the game doesn't properly track which shy guy you killed it's just like you killed an enemy in this room it must have been the one with the calculator there you go Whack, whack. Oh god, hold B. Oh, that didn't actually lose any time. Whack! Oh my god, okay, that did though. Ugh. Okay. I need to get better at doing whack whacks. I mean, I literally don't care about this run, but. Also, F's in the chat for Wacka. Snap back again. Wacka is no more. Also, I hate this part of the run just because it seems so slow. Like, we can't combine it with anything. We we give this letter to this toad. We run all the way to chapter 5, then we run all the way back, and we just... That's all we're doing. But there's really no other way around it, unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> no, nobody wants to play it on Wii U either. But the thing is... So, like, Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask on Wii U... Theoretically is faster. Or, to my understanding, theoretically is faster to play on those consoles. But the level of control you have is just so completely terrible. And the number and frequency of like precise tricks that you have to do all the time to make that game work, just you would never actually be able to get Wii U to save time to the fullest extent that it could, if that makes sense. Whereas with Paper Mario, the, like, yeah, you'll drop inputs here and there. But I mean, usually the worst thing that's going to happen is like, oh, God, I didn't jump out of a spin which is insignificant in comparison. Like, I remember whenever, okay, so whenever all of the stuff about, like, you know, whenever the debug menu was Wii U exclusive and that was the big thing in MM, I remember watching uh, Kyle, uh, I remember watching like Full Grown Gaming trying to, they, they had a route figured out that would be like Wii U exclusive. And he was trying to do it and he just could not, for the life of him, get this one trick that's like standard in Hundo. Uh, to work some kind of, it was like some grotto uh, alternate exit or something he just could not get the trick to work he was trying for like hours like that like that's the kind of thing you're dealing with where there's no trick that you just like can't do yeah the debug mini remember when that was the thing and almost killed the entire uh... but like honestly for mm's sake thank god for SRM. one thing i like to do sometimes is take people who are you know like twitch partners now or maybe not necessarily partners but just go watch people's like really old PBs and I remember I went back and watched the first ever uh, run that Glower got that got uh, like an any percent world record and at the end of it he was talking about how Wii U was coming out soon and how that we'll have to see how that changes things up and also he's like I might go to I might I might try and improve glitch improve glitchless and try and like maybe get sub four if that's even possible yeah yeah sandbox games like, I wouldn't call, for instance, I wouldn't call Paper Mario a sandbox game, but the fact that it's, you know, just kind of open, you can go around the whole world, and it's not bound by, oh my god, that's, that's my least favorite thing about trying to break, there's a reason why none of the games past TTYD are just completely busted uh, in the Paper Mario series. Like, Super Paper Mario, you guys want to know stuff about Super Paper Mario? You can clip through almost any wall, there's a glitch that lets you gain infinite height, like, those two glitches exist, and yet the Any% percent run still plays and beats every single individual level. Okay, yeah, so what I'm gonna do, I don't think... Yeah, it's like 106. I'm, so I'm gonna finish Chapter 7 just for practice, and then that's gonna be it. 
because yeah, this run is pretty bad. <laughs> and also, it's late. Okay, but I think I'm actually gonna call it there because yeah, this run's not going anywhere, and it's like it's past one, and it's getting late. So, <laughs> not gonna drag it out. So we'll, yeah, we'll go ahead and call it there. There will be more Hundo tomorrow though, so don't worry. And hopefully I don't accidentally do a tutorial in after chapter one. <laughs> so then we can, you know, not just be finishing chapter one at one in the morning. <laughs> yeah, have a good night, guys. Right, let me find someone to, uh, let's, let's go raid somebody, though.